when it comes to making videos for you guys, I always look for new games. So ones that are recent and are relevant, um, ones on a good price. Like, I mean, this game here, Dark Treasury, is what we're looking at today. It just came out January 31st, I think it is, and the price was under five bucks, which is perfect for these kinds of videos. But I just want to share with you my experience with this game. Um, even though it's got positive reviews on Steam, my experience with it wasn't exactly as rosy as I would have hoped. So here we are, fired up the game and greeted with pixel art and otherwise a start button. So I went ahead and played and this is my experience right off the get go. I couldn't figure out what the controls were. There's no tutorial. There was no indication as to what I should be doing in order to succeed at playing this game. And what went from a great deal quickly turned into a huge frustration. Now, if you watch me play here, I die over and over and over again. It took me about five or 10 times to actually find the keys on the keyboard that I could use to actually play. And once I figured that out, you know, things went a little bit better, but it really, it really was frustrating because I mean, you, I've played computer games here for more than 30 years now. Like I'm not a new player or someone who hasn't had a chance playing games, but the interface or the playing on this really gave you no indication as to what to push. Later, I did notice that there was buttons on the top up by the, maybe the life bar. I can't even tell if it's the life bar, but it just really, it really kind of didn't work out well for me. And then as things went on, I finally figured out the buttons, but then I figured out that you had to swing your sword before they got to you, the monsters got to you. And the timing was very important because if you didn't hit them soon enough, that was it. It seemed that you maybe got hit three times. I'm not even sure, still not even sure as to how many times you can take a hit before you're dead. And anyway, this game went from what seemed like a good deal and seemed like a good review candidate or game for this channel to basically a headache inducing uh, stress ball of an experience. So, I mean, you can try this game if you'd like, like there are positive reviews on Steam, but it's also kind of fishy too. They are pretty generalized and people playing not a lot of time. So, I mean, spend your money where you will, but from my point of view, I wouldn't spend money on this game and just quick to refund it. So, anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's gameplay. Let me know if you played this game because it didn't work out for me.